watch this. <laughs> so, like, the funniest thing yeah, is... Like, to get me cancer. Um, <laughs> he's he's going to get me cancer. So, a man has to bring something to the table for a woman to want to be with him. A man is not going to be able to stay with a woman unless he's paying bills or he's he attributing or doing something. Even if it comes to the sex, it don't matter. He's yeah. doing something that will make him want to stay around because any man can give you sex. But if he doing it to you right how you like it, you'll keep him around. But even if he don't, we still be trying to put around because women are just that type of compassion. Hell like, no. Yeah. We really <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> Whoa, well, no, can't no, quick, wait, wait, you can't say that on the radio. Oh. Can't say that. Oh, it's all right. It's all right. Please. Yeah, but how many women out here taking care of men and how many men out here taking care of women? It's like mm -hmm. an 80-20 ratio. Oh. I don't oh, think that matters. Man. I just feel, I personally yeah. feel like as a black man, because well, y'all don't want to talk about how black women are the most compassionate for our black men and we love our black men. Even done dirty and we are lied to, cheated mm -hmm. on, we still love our black men. We don't look at these white men, these Asian men, uh -huh. these Timbuktu men. She's we don't look not at right. I'm going to keep it a book. We don't look I, at none of this them. This sound good, but I'm a, we on social media all the time. Women be y'all be dogging us on social media every change I get. Let's keep it a book. Every time I look at the comments, well, we talk to them again, Trent. Because I seen a video. Hey, man, hey, I man, said, well, at the end of the day, I want my man to cheat. See, man, that's true. Man. I'm, not, I'm not saying black man don't cheat. I don't cheat because I'm here to wait love. I'm gonna love you how you supposed to be loved. Yeah, but <laughs> if, I, if black man do cheat, just like any other race of man cheat. But women can do some more dirtier stuff. That's why men do the things they do too because. I see a video where a woman, they was together for eight years, but she said every time I got free, I went and messed with somebody else. Oh. So, wow. a man can go cheat with a girl and then be upset that he cheated on her but want to work it out with you. But the whole time you was cheating, but you make him feel like you never did, but the whole time you was cheating with eight or nine different men. Because oh. women are, are way better at hiding stuff than men are. That's a fact, too. They yeah. smarter than us. So, they smarter than right. us. Right, see, a girl say, I ain't never cheated on you, but really messing with your daddy. Oh, oh, okay, the dad. See how many, how many, how many dudes, was, how many dudes you know out here messing with a girl and their mama and their sister too. I That's mean, but crazy. but women like a mom wouldn't sit. Uh, well, uh oh, oh well, well, I well, don't well, know. City girls down ten points, right? Are you know what I'm saying? Boy, please. <laughs> see y'all, y'all took the city girl stuff and took off with it. We got hot boys that and say, nah, y'all can keep that. Oh. Nah, I still feel like I still feel like men, y'all still get unconditional love, and even if y'all don't get it from. Like, even, I feel like, if, regardless, if a man can still get love, like, boy, mothers love they, they boys unconditionally. And y'all be, and that's yeah, the crazy On the family thing. side? Yeah, on the family side. Uh, course, what's the last man you love unconditionally other than your father? Uh, my ex that I plan on getting with, I don't find nobody by the time I'm 30. Uh, oh. duh. I well, still love know, him you know, unconditionally. Right here, but we ain't gonna talk about that right now either. I so, still love him. Your ex, what? How did it end? Why did it end? Why did it end? Oh, I mean, we're not here to talk about. I mean, no, I'm trying to get to unconditional. So what happened? If it was unconditional, what led to it ending? Because if it's unconditional, y'all still be together. It had to be some type of condition that broke it up. Mm. Well, no, nah, that's the thing. Like, if it's unconditional love, but long distance schedules, okay. and really just the whole fathom of you know, he's in the navy. He's been going through a lot of things with like the navy. Okay. Um, boot camp and stuff. You get a pass. You get a pass. Yeah, no, like, she don't. So I haven't. I haven't gotten the chance to you know be around him as much as I wanted to. And no, with don't. everything that there's I do, there's a lot of wives out here that got men in the military, and they still love my condition. But there's a lot. There's also exactly. a lot of wives. My who, granny did it for thirty years. There's also a lot of wives who aren't wives yet, who are twenty one, who are college students, that also be doing things within the band, doing things with the oars, and they're also doing things outside the career, working mm. at restaurants. Mm. There's people who still be trying to make their fucking dreams come true. That, that's true. But y'all, y'all a pair, right? Excuse and me. I know the tears you say it all the time, one band, one sound. We never said so, that. Y'all need to. Dallas Austin said that. We never said that. <laughs> she, Dallas, she Dallas Austin said that. Dallas Austin, Dallas. We but never I heard the TSU students say that. We never But when you're a couple and your love is that hot and you're that emotionally attached to another person, space is not going to stop y'all from being together regardless. I bet so you uh, I I It didn't stop us from being together. It just kind of stopped. Like... We still love each other to this day. Like, that love will forever be there, but sometimes love just isn't enough. If you're not with the, each other to have that compassion on a daily basis. And then, mentally, you get to a point where you feel like you need that compassion. Like, oh, man, I had a long day. Like, all I want to do is just be yeah. around someone and have those good vibes change. And sometimes, 
when they not there, them, them vibes don't change. I'm gonna have to side with her on that one just because everybody got their love language and everything they need. So if I'm not getting what I need from a relationship, even if I love you, I, I can't stay. But we can we can work through it until we get to a point where we can come back together. I do believe in the statement if it's real, it'll come back anyway. So I kind of understand what she's saying there. So I, this is so this is like a fifty fifty conversation we can have. 50, 50. So. I got another question, you know, I'm, I'm like starting He's controversy. He's just here with I'm the questions. I'm just here. So is it okay to be single with multiple people you talk to, but the one person you mainly talking to, you know you talk to other people and they feel some type of way about it. Can they feel some type of way about that? Not if you not if you set the expectation and told them everything up front, no. They they signed on and said, I'm going to be a part of this. They knew what I was doing. They can't be mad about it. If they get mad about it, then they, they're emotionally immature because we talk, had a conversation about this. Now, they can also remove themselves from the situation. They don't want to be a part of it, but I don't think they should. They have a right to get mad, but they don't have a right to get mad at me because we talked about it. So. Repeat the question. So it's, all, so it's okay to have choices. It's pretty much what it is. It's okay to have choices. Most if you're single? Yeah. yeah, if you're single. If you're single, yeah. Like, if you're single talking to somebody, though. Single okay? and talking to somebody? Yeah. If you're Y'all not dating. If you're talking to somebody, you're talking to somebody. Like, that's that's what it is. Okay. I don't think that you should have. I really don't think that it's okay to have options while you're talking. Cause that's y'all problem. Y'all want every single option. Like y'all want to be able to say, we okay, money. We don't I got a girl in the world. See, I think I just a, want you. That's a difference no, between dating and talking. Yeah, like what's yeah. the difference between talking I, and to and me dating. dating and talking is the same thing. Same. I also it's think almost is. You don't think dating but some people no. ain't having sex while you're talking. Some people just talking. That's true. That is true. That's not talking. That is true. That's <laughs> that's, 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 that's the get together. That's not. No, that's the friend will benefit. No, a friend would benefit is if you... See, because I know some girls, and I'm not going to lie, I know some girls that they talk mm-hmm. to somebody, but they sleep with somebody else. Mm. But they, they really like that person, person, though, but they're not ready to let go of the person they already making love to. TSU. Nah. That's, 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 that's messy. That's messy. That's messy. But that's just like cute. women are doing that. And y'all know it, dude, because y'all look, both looking at me like, yeah, he right. Because y'all got the, friends. I'm looking at the same thing. Y'all got friends that's, that's doing the same thing out here. I mean, I, I don't do know that business. Like, right, like it's. I, I know a girl. I know a girl right now. She on a cruise with another dude, but her, her, her man at home right now. Oh. See, oh. we ain't gonna get to that either. Oh. But nah, y'all know we gonna be right oh. back with this conversation right after this song. <laughs> I messed up. You crazy? Get into it. <laughs> nah. The radio is crazy.